Hallo zusammen. You know, just because I'm a native German doesn't mean that I agree with every single phrase and expression that we have in our German language. No, I actually don't. I think some of them are really strange. And I keep hearing and reading this expression I would like to talk about today very often. And every single time I think to myself, what a wonderful world. No, no, I rather think something along the lines of, okay, I get it's a popular and frequently used expression, like it's 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 common, but still, it 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 doesn't really make sense, like semantically, meaning-wise, that is. Why do Germans use this phrase in the first place and so often? Let's learn more about the phrase "recht herzlich" today, and why I think it's pretty special. The expression recht herzlich is usually used at the end of a conversation, and it's related to expressing gratitude for something. The term recht is an adverb. In English it translates to something like quite, relatively, pretty or fairly. Herzlich is an adjective which is comparable. It's herzlich, herzlicher, am herzlichsten, affectionate, sincere or heartfelt. Typical exemplary sentences would be Ich danke Ihnen recht herzlich. I thank you or thank you quite sincerely. Recht herzlichen Dank. Quite sincere gratitude or thanks. But as you might have figured from these sentences alone, it's a pretty strange combination of words to begin with. But honestly, and that's pretty much the main reason I think it's weird to use this expression in the first place, why would you want to thank someone only quite sincerely and not sincerely or wholeheartedly or heartfelt thanks heartfelt quality of gratitude why would you add this limitation the semantic limitation quite recht herzlich and not just herzlich you know i really don't get it I mean, there's definitely a difference in the expressed quality of gratitude when you compare thanks to thank you so very much. No one could really deny that. But I'd say you either thank someone wholeheartedly, meaning you express heartfelt gratitude from the bottom of your heart, or you thank someone in an ordinary, normal and more neutral way by simply saying thank you or even thank you very much. The phrase recht herzlich though is, well, somewhat in between. And that's strange. It's commonly used at the end of phone calls. Recht herzlichen Dank, auf Wiedersehen. It's a rather formal expression as well. That's why I chose the exemplary sentence Ich danke Ihnen recht herzlich, because Ihnen is the dative plural form of the formal form of address Sie. You might reply this to your boss, for instance. You wouldn't use recht herzlich or similar phrases that include these two terms in informal situations though. I can't and I don't want to deny that this expression is really friendly and polite. There's nothing wrong with it in that sense, but then again, it remains a mystery to me. It, it really does. I'm not kidding, gotta be honest, I can't recall a single situation in which I've used this phrase. Ich danke Ihnen recht herzlich, aber nur recht herzlich und nicht einfach nur herzlich. Denn so nett bin ich nicht. So obviously I wonder what you make of this. If you're a fellow German, if you're also German and watching this video, have you ever used this expression and what do you think of it? Because I don't think and I hope that I'm not the only one thinking this is weird. And to all of my other viewers, have you heard of this phrase before? And is there a similar phrase, a similar strange phrase in your language? If so, tell me in the comments. And also, well, thanks for watching. I'm your vlog Dave. Tschüss und bis zum nächsten Mal. Recht herzlichen Dank fürs Zuschauen.